The fish families we will discuss in this section are those which have a large oval form. The first family in this group is the Acanthuridae, or surgeon fish. These are recognizable by a sharp scalpel at the base of their tail. The next family is the Saganidae, or rabbit fish. This family can be recognized by their large, dark eyes and small, somewhat rabbit-like mouths. The last family belonging to this group is the Caesionidae, or fusiliers. You can recognize this family by their deeply forked tails and torpedo-shaped bodies, which are meant to swim long distances quite fast, similar to a tuna. The first family in this group is the Acanthuridae, or surgeon fish. These are recognizable by the sharp scalpel at the base of the tail, hence the common name surgeon fish. The unicorn fish also belong to this family and can be recognized by their elongate body and elongate nose. Surgeon fish are approximately 40 centimeters long and live on the reef. Their diet consists of algae, which they forage for on the reef in shoals. The main body color of surgeon fish is often quite dark to black, though there are a few notable exceptions. Unicorn fish often have gray body color with some pattern. A few species of surgeon fish will be shown to highlight the characteristics from this family. First up is Acanthurus dusumieri. These are distinguished by their bluish-green bodies and bright blue tails with dark spots. You can also notice the bright yellow band across the eye and the white scalpel at the tail base. Next is Zebrosoma scopas. These are smaller than the other Acanthuridae species and have a bright white scalpel. Their bodies are brown, with very fine blue spots near the head and lines stretching towards the tail. Notice the mouth is very elongated and small. Next is Acanthurus xanthopterus. These are a dark olive color with a mottled dark pattern and bright yellow pectoral fins. These also have a yellow band over the eyes and a curved tail fin. The next species is Acanthurus triostegas. These are yellow and white with six thin and vertical dark bars down the length of the body. Notice the tail fin is straight. The next species is Acanthurus leucosternon. These have a very noticeable color pattern which is mainly blue with a black head, yellow dorsal fin, white anal fins, and a black and white striped tail fin. Next is Tinochetus binatatus. These are a light brown color with thin light blue patterning all over the body. Notice there are two black dots at the end of the dorsal and anal fin and a bright blue eye rim. Next up is Tinochetus striatus. This species looks very similar to Tinochetus binotatus, but these don't have the two dark spots near the tail and have a yellow rim around the eye, not blue. The next species is Naso elegans. These are a light brown color with a bright yellow outline running from the base of the mouth to behind the eye and all the way to the tail. They also have a yellow patch over the tail base and a tail outlined in black. Next is Naso unicornis, the unicorn fish. It is often bigger than the other Acanthuridae species and has a large horn shape between the eyes, hence the common name. They also have two bright blue patches over the scalpels and long tail filaments on the top and bottom. Next is Naso brevirostris. These also have a horn and a body which is light brown. However, these have a thick light blue bar behind the head and covering the pectoral fin. They also have a dark brown mottling pattern over the body and a light colored tail. Lastly, we have Paracanthurus hepatis. This species was the inspiration behind Dory in Finding Nemo. It has a characteristic black pattern on the back. The second family of the large oval fish group is the Saganidae, or rabbit fish. This family can be recognized by their small, somewhat rabbit-like mouths and large, dark eyes. Saganidae species are approximately 20 centimeters long and live on seagrass meadows. Their diet consists of algae and seagrass for which they forage in schools. The fish in this family are mostly silver in color, with some patterns being seen. We will go through a few species in the Saganidae family, which will help highlight the characteristics of this family and help in identification. 
The first species in the Saganidae family is Saganus luridus. These are a light brown with a mottled color pattern and a light blue patch under the eye. While their fins are clear, the fin bases are slightly yellow. Next is Saganus stellatus. This species is characterized by their white body and the many black spots covering them from head to tail. The dorsal and anal fins have black stripes running through them and the tail has a white outline. And lastly, we have Saganus suter. This rabbitfish has two color pattern options. Pictured is the variegated color pattern where their silver body is covered with white spots and faint vertical bars. A second color variation is plain silver, which is used when the species is crossing reefs or plain sand. The third family of the fish families with large oval form is the family Caesionidae, or Fusiliers. They are recognizable by their small mouth, torpedo-shaped body, and deeply forked tail. They are approximately 20 centimeters long, and they live above the reef, eating zooplankton in large schools. The fish in this family are mostly blue and yellow. Here are a few species in the Caesionidae family, which will help highlight the characteristics of this family and help in identification. Firstly is Caesio xanthonota. The top half of this species is a bright yellow color, and the bottom is a light blue to silver. Notice the dark spot at the base of the pectoral fin. Next is Caesio lunaris. These are a plain silver blue color with black tips on the end of its tail. Next up is Caesio xanthalatos. These are a blue green color with a large horizontal yellow stripe down the length of its body, which is edged in white. This stripe continues down into the tail. Also notice the large dark pectoral spot. Next is Caesio teres. These look similar to Caesio xanthonota at the beginning, however the yellow is restricted to the back of the body and tail in this species. And lastly, we have Caesio ceruleria. This species resembles Caesio xanthalitos, however the horizontal yellow stripe is much thinner and fades to black near the tail. Notice that the tail has two dark stripes through it. Quiz time! We have a small overview to test your knowledge of the families within the large ovals group. Which family belong to the Acanthuridae, Siganidae, and Caesionidae families? Pause the video to see how you do. Are you ready? Here are a few tips for getting these correct. Remember that Acanthuridae, or surgeonfish, have a distinct scalpel on the tail base. Siganidae, or rabbitfish, have the somewhat rabbit-shaped mouth. And Caesionidae, or fusiliers, by their deeply forked tails and torpedo-shaped bodies. Thanks for watching. Check out the next video to continue your fish identification.